Hello, Gothic friends. Razgun well, is my name. Welcome back to the worst Let's Play of the World, Gothic 1 Unreal Engine. In today's episode, we have to find some fire lizards and cut their tongues. We could actually go to the orc land and try to kill some of them there, find some. I believe I know where some could be. So we are going to go there. Sadly, we have no teleports to them, to any of the region. Tuxardas would have been the closest, but I'm too stupid to find a way to get out of the tower without trial and error. I don't know if that was always the case. I believe in the original, you could just jump into the water, into the lake. But in this version, the lake is quite gone. We also have to level up quite a bit because we have to learn the two-handed sword. Because I believe later on, once we advance in the story, we are not going to be able to learn that, so we have to keep that in mind also. With that said, we are better to go up here where we were with Milton and continue that way to Xardas, to the orcs, the ranks of orcs and level up in the meantime. I think that would be smart. Still not sure what we should actually do. We do have a powerful spell, which... Yeah, they have no more res respect for, so what? I, would have enjoyed polishing your mug. I bet you would. So, not sure should we do that, actually. Go that way. Actually, we want to have better armor. Oh, we forgot to talk with Wolf and give him the stuff for the armor. Could we do that? And then go to Xardas. Yeah, I think that's the best way. We will just jump from the Xardas Tower. Otherwise, it's going to take forever. I'm not sure if we, if we can get the Minecrawler armor. We shall see. Damn it. Damn it, damn it. From here, we will die. Right? Oh, okay, not bad. We could take this little damage. Wolf, my friend. The sound is weird. But whatever. I've gathered lots of Minecrawler's armor plates. Fantastic. I'll get to work immediately. How long will it take? I haven't the faintest idea. This is a completely new development, man. Just drop by now and then when you're in the area. Okay, so we don't know when he's going to have it ready. How far have you got with the armor? It's going to take some time, man. Those plates are really heavy stuff. I still haven't found a way yet to fix them together. Give me some more time. Okay. Do you trade? Yeah, you don't have anything that we need. So, oh, again, Sardas or no Sardas? Let's go to Sardas. So the demon is still there. Yeah, from here we have no exit, sadly, so we have to get up in the air. And from there, jump. Probably we are strong enough to take the damage and just heal ourselves. Let's check it. Does Sardas have anything for us? Hey, you! Hey, you, Stiffy. I'm seeking. Ah, okay, he doesn't have anything for us. So this is very deadly. There, there used to be the water, or there is, but further away. I believe the way we did it was get up here. From one of the spikes. Yeah, from this spike. Jump down there. Okay, we manage it. We have to spend a lot of more money on the speeding potions. That wouldn't be bad at all. So I'm curious, that's where the way that we come, Sardas. Does it have a way to get away from him? Like this way? Would it take us to the fire lizards? We are just occasionally strolling through the orc lands. Is a plant? No. 
what is up there ah there they are okay perfect then we can just go to the valley of mines uh we are in the valley of mines sorry we can just go to the a rock do we deal any damage to them four of them even Oh, we killed all of them. Good, we are good. Yeah, the mage is quite easy. Yes, finally. Leveling up wouldn't be bad, right? I don't think up here is anything left. So lucky that we ported here and we actually found them. There is a cave, some razor down there. Bite us, okay. I have no clue where we are, no need to die. Okay, so we got what we wanted to, which is quite easy, not as I expected. Now we can go to the Ulumulu guy. What wouldn't have been bad if we were leveling up, but. It is what it is. We will learn it once we come out of the cave. I believe there are some orcs, not orcs, a uh, uh, troll that respawned. Some swamp sharks respawned in the swamp. So we will check it after this chapter. Once we start the fifth chapter, we have better armors. We will have a lot more money once we sell stuff and then we can simply buy many potions of the speed and just run around the world and kill everything. So those guys are still here. Why aren't you with Gorn protecting the mine? They didn't come from here, so there is no reason for you guys to be here, right? The old camp guards came from other route. Curious, which route could have that been? This one, maybe? To the mountains and then down here? Could be. That's why the stairs there the steps yeah we need a potion time for a speed potion actually we need a lot more of those oh yes much much better that means we'll have to sell a lot of stuff get the potions for ourselves otherwise it's going to take forever to keep running back and forth yeah i forgot about the fire lizard we could have Kill some of them before we went into the mine. And we could have saved some time, but also not bad this way. Guard still protecting. Is he going to yeah, he's going to come back into the mine with us. Yeah, there was the hidden path. Okay, we can take the damage, I believe, right? Oh, this is quite high, but let's check. Ah, uh, never mind. We can take the damage. Light, there shall be right. Light, okay. Yeah, nice, we can cast it during walking. Gordon is going to be lost. We are almost there. Is he going to attack us again? No, he is just sad now. Ulumulu is ours. I have all four items for the Ulumulu. Stranger, strong warrior B. Give items. Tarak make Ulumulu. Right Here. now? Stranger wear Ulumulu and proud. Tarak sleep now. You going to die? Oh, fifth chapter. Nice. Did we bug ourselves? 
No, okay. Got scared for a bit. So, Ulu Mulu. Where could you be? Is it a special? Ah, okay. They change it. They did change it, all right. Ulumulu is not a weapon anymore, it's simply an amulet. Do we see it? I believe it is on our No, we don't see it. We don't see it, okay. So the Ulumulu used to be a strange looking words type. That you had to carry on your back. Now we can simply equip it and no orcs is going to attack us unless we provoke them. We are in the fifth chapter. Quite strong. Now we have to get some level ups. Like for real. If we want to get more. Yeah, we are only level 24 in the fifth chapter. That's not normal if I play the normal game and not trying to keep it consistent. I, otherwise... I will just keep clearing everything. Normally I'm level 20 something in the first chapter without joining any faction. We need better spells, so Kronos and Riordian might have better spells for us. Gordon got lost somewhere, right? Yeah, there he is. He, here is his safe point in case you get too far away from him. He must be rich. He got some weapons from us. That's an interesting orc standard you have there. How do you see it? From the former orc slave in the mine? It's an orcish symbol for friendship. I want to enter the orc town with it. I hope for your sake that the orcs will respect this thing if not then we are just going to kill them we will not see each other again right how's it going everything's quiet nothing's moving in the free mine lee is still busy organizing our defense how's the situation everything's quiet it can't be long now i'll just see you So we can go back to the <coughs> water mages again. That for us, hey, are you going to sell us your beautiful robe now? I'd like to wear the high robe of water. The time has come. You are worthy of wearing the high robe of water. Finally, thank you. May you return in one piece. Why are you asking? Oh, questioning. Nice. It's very beautiful. Show me your good. Yeah, show us your. Nothing. That, wow, look at here. 360. So what do we have here? Warrior's voice. Old judge we don't need. Bonebreaker, very strong one-handed weapon. That's actually what we are going to use for now. The orc hammer we are going to need. Lots and lots of weapons. Look at this. So all those are dexterity. Wow, look at the bows, how many we got. We need one of them later on, I know, a bow, so that's why we keep saving them. This we don't need, the high robe of fire we don't need for what, actually. This we don't need anymore. Alright, a uh, storm of fire we don't need, we have, I mean, we do need, but we have one extra. And all of those things we don't need. So 
Minecrawler eggs and plates I have no clue if we need. We have to smoke some things. Yeah, look how rich we are now, like for real. Those things we take all. Okay, we got a lot and with the rest of money, 36,000 we need, okay. How many do we want to buy? 5,000? Yeah, let's buy for 5,000. And the rest is okay. So, we got that. But no new spells? Who sells us the fire rain and stuff? We level up, so let's see if we can learn the second, the first one handed. Oh, this is not better than this. I thought it would be better than this, but no. That one we can sell also. And the work weapons. We have more than enough money for the time being. Lee? Hey, you! I want to learn how to handle a two handed sword. Okay, let's go through the basics first. Okay, listening Hold the to you. sword in a horizontal position. You'll need a great swing to attack your opponent with such a heavy weapon. Raise your arm and swing it straight down. That's usually enough to knock the opponent down. Use the momentum of the weapon to bring it straight back up again. Two-handed swords are ideal for coordinating side hits to keep the opponents at a distance. That should do to begin with. Have a practice. Okay. Two-handed, okay. I want... I can't. Why can't you? I, want, I can't teach you any. Okay, because we don't have enough experience. So, now we can equip this sword. We can't use... Uh, we need one level up for extra strength. Or we get a better... Drink. Okay, I didn't know that. But now we don't have a powerfuller, a better two-handed. Means we need more strength, five extra strength. Was it five? Four. Okay. One we have because we have one extra strength anyway. Who can teach us that? Torlov. Hmm. Or Wolf, yeah, Wolf is the one that can teach us. Maybe he can give us the mind crawler plate now. That would be bad because we already have this armor that we spend money on. But I really wanted to have it. How far did you get with the armor? I finally found a way to fix those armor plates to each other. Does that mean that the armor is finished? Yeah, man, here it is. Really seems to be harder than any other armor in our camp. Oh, that's a bit weird. Thanks, I owe you something. That's all right. I always find ways of covering my expenses. Yeah, see, this is a bit weird. I'm looking. I can't. Can your deck? I can't. Three more dexterity. But why does it say this is better? Because of the protection against fire and against magic. We will use this one instead, and the other one when we fight with mages. Ah, oh, we look so awesome. Too bad we got both of them at once, sadly. So now we can go to Xardas and tell the guy what happened. I want to. Do so you have anything? I believe yeah, he got better. Drinks, mana, no. Storm of fire, we don't need. Death to the undead, we don't need. Oh, he got nothing actually. Here, take this sword. I mean, this axe. So we look powerful now. What we can do now? What quest do we have? Get into the temple of sleeper and that's it, okay. Any merchants? Yeah, there are some merchants that we can check. Let's go to the swampy people. Yeah, yeah. And then to Xardas. Okay, 
Those guys don't care at all what happened here. So we need to level up. We are not far away. If there are some swamp sharks, we are going to kill them. Get the rest of the strength that we need. I mean, five strength we will learn, and then we will just pump it into the dexterity, into the strength, the next ones. And then two more levels for the next level two, one-handed. Well, Kadar, do you have anything powerful for us, please? I want to. Emotions. Last 15 strength would be perfect. Nah, okay. Control. Thornfish, we have telekinesis. Friendship. Pyrokinesis. Fist of Wind and Storm. Okay, this. Sleep. Wow. Lots of new spells. Control. What does the control do? No sorcery. Sorry. The right decision. Not for us. Storm fist. Is it powerful? The right decision. Oh! Are asking for an urgent <sighs> beating. Okay, this is powerful. Another one. Stay here, you pussy. What? I'm here. You pussy. Telekinesis is the one to. Pyrokinesis. This is fire damage. Yeah, this looks good. We have to check it. Not to do. Not you. But you. So, time to check the swamp sharks. If there are any, they are more than welcome to be killed now. Because we want to learn the two level, two handed one, two handed two, level two. Normally they send us here and the swamp sharks should respawn. Okay, there is a new blood fly that spawned. we have to get with this because we cannot see the swamp sharks anymore i don't believe there are going to be any of them yeah it doesn't look like there are any of the swamp sharks respond okay then we should go to xardas Let's see if he cares about it, and he might have some beautiful stuff to sell. Right, wait a second, we, we have some summons, right? Summon column, summon skeleton. And we can directly try to kill them, let's check it. We need more mana. Right, where is the summoning on seven? Ooh. Okay, this still works. Luckily, they just want to die. Oh, sometimes three, sometimes two. Ah, one of them is, I believe, outside. That means we have to summon them somewhere else. Like here.
Yeah, the other one is outside, somewhere outside. This is not cheating, this is the way the game works. We buy those spells and instead of using them on people. We have a golem to beat. Four of them actually. And this should be the last patch, I believe, or... No, we have one more. This should be the last match. Till now. What about our experience? Okay, we could actually just go to the camp again and increase our strength. But first we talk with Sardas and see what he wants from, from us. Okay, we are done with that. That means we need a next. There are only four golems. Ooh, 1000 experience. I do dig that. A fight. Oh, are you going to attack us? That was it then. What do you oh. want with that weapon? What weapon? Smart decision. Fight. That was it then. Yeah, that was it. Smart decision. So we have one more to summon, yes. Maybe he has more enemies for us to summon. We hit a dead enemies also yeah the swords and stuff we will collect after I believe or they disappear they are good money we need money to buy more stuff from Sardas Nice, nice. Let's go to Xartas. Does he even care that we have the Ulumulu? We actually don't really need the Ulumulu, we can simply just beat everyone. Hey you! I'm seeking magic knowledge. Ah, okay. He doesn't have absolutely nothing new. Pink monster, summon demon, okay. Summon golem. Summon skeletons, okay. That means we have to sell those weapons also. Ooh, we need a lot more stuff to sell. Those things we don't need. We have weapon. We have uh, scrolls. Only we need mana. The mana is perfect for us. This piece of an ice column we don't need. The 
the X. I don't know if it's really needed for something. Uh, the Okay, we are out of money, but we can level up again. And weird that Xardas really doesn't care at all. So we have to level up one more time, right? Now we have two more times leveled. Okay, we will go then to waters. Increase our strength five more times. We don't need this weapon. Ah, we will. We are going to get a warrior's voice. Uh, Berserker, what? Warrior's voice, yeah. Hang on. And after that, yeah, we can do such things. And after that, we have to fight more orcs or clear a bit of the world now because we are in the fifth chapter anyway. Can you keep your decks? Okay, 76 for the time being. Yeah, we don't hold it to that right. Put the weapon down. Lucky for you. Yeah, don't make me kill you now. I need I can help. So, we have 80 mana, pure mana. With that said, we are going to try to run to well we have to level up and in order to level up we have to kill our summons but for that we are going to go to the old mine that we need later on for now we need only that at the orkish talisman we can sell also yeah we have some summon spells that we can actually use we are going to do to walk to the old mine and see if there are some monsters and we have some enemies to kill there anyway. They are perfect for leveling up. And while we have the speeds, we can just use that as a way of getting there. In the next episode, we have to do some clearing. As I said, I believe once we go to the sleeper's temple, to the orc town that we have now we will not be able to learn anymore the two-handed oh, i thought we would kill it finally oh there is also a molaret that spawned here oh why why do we keep missing And the effect of the potion is already gone. Damn it, I wish it would be. It would last at least five minutes. Yeah, I know. Beautiful wishes. So, is there anything up there? We have an hour, almost one hour worth of speed up, so. We can use that. I really forgot what's up here. If it is something or it's just added from the game. Ah, okay. The troll that the guy sent us. Yeah, lucky he's slower than our... It's... Nice. 200 experience, that's very good. But that's what was here. There is nothing going to spawn after we clear them now, that's why I like to do it in the 5th chapter. Yeah, there is a gate, it didn't really collapse, they got just closed. If you would cheat it, I believe you could get into the mine and everyone would be just fine. Yeah, this is a bit so fast, 1 minute I believe. Oh, Shadow Beast, okay. What are you going to attack? We need better spells. And more mana. 
Oh, a molar rat, okay. Up here are also molar rats, I heard. Blood flies, yeah, lots of stuffs. Found here. Yeah, he's just looking at the spell that we use. I do like to clear everything monster wise in this playthrough. Because, as I said, oh, there are a lot more enemies here. Easy ones, but we will come back to the scavenger. Did anything spawn back there? Ah, two blood flies. Yeah, lurkers, okay. We have to kill those stuffs. Yeah, the next episode is going to be about clearing and clearing and clearing. More monsters spawn here, even goblins. Oh, where did you come from? Where did you come from, my friend? As you see, we need a lot of money. We are very poor right now. We have nothing more. So I guess we are going to go to where the archers are going to be and then we will clear them later on. And I still can't believe that we killed a Shadow Beast and a Troll here. I totally didn't expect them to be here. There is also nothing stopping us from killing every single orc. Fifty mana and thirty is perfect. Snappers, okay. Okay, don't stuck, don't get stuck, please. Luckily there is no problem. We have teleport stones. There is a Seraphis. Slowly looks like we are going to clear this forest and then the other forest and then the other forest. We are going to be busy just a little bit. The scavenger we are going to go uh, once we get out of this forest we have to go that route anyway nothing new here right nope i hear no sounds no noises nothing snappy yeah you give a lot of experience in gothic one Gothic 2, almost half of it, 120 only. But they are not as powerful as here. So back there should be nothing more. Oh, a troll again. Ah, I forgot we deal no damage to the troll. One more troll spawned here. And some plants, so didn't we collect them last time? Or we were too busy fighting. So, then let's kill the troll. Nice, another level up. As I said, we need to level up to get a next level of two-handed. And here is where we wanted to, to get anyway. We will level up with the summons that we have and the enemies that are here. So, I'm going to make a cut here and in the next episode we will clear this part of the camp that they have there. They are not implemented, sadly, those to any quest. So, thank you very much guys for joining me. I'll see you in the next episode. Be cool and bye-bye.